Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In this video, we are going to learn how we can export interfaces and type by which we can make our properties more optimized in React with the TypeScript. So what is the purpose? What is the use? Just understand. For example, I create one more component here. I say that component of CSS props to .tsx. For example, same coding from here. I just paste there, copy this and I paste here. In place of classes, I say Dr. Vipin Tevatiya and I save this and I just use this two also and here also I use two as a name of the component. Now I call this also here. Just I copy this here and I paste it. I pass here and I say it is two and I just copy this and I import this here and I say it is two and it is two and I save this and same property we are passing here but in place of color red I here pass green color I save this and if you see the output we have one is green color like this one is a red color but the purpose is not to show you the color purpose is to optimize on export the properties that is common for example here these two components having a same kind of property and having a same type of data type of interface and you may have a type also that means i am declaring a two time one here and second here and it is an example of just a small property but in a large application development web development we have so many common properties those repeatedly we use in different different components and we increase the size of the code so here i just example i have this code that is repeatedly i am using in this here the purpose is the simple but the understanding is more if you understand it that we have a some part of data type interface or type are common that is repeatedly we are using in different different components. So how we can create a one simple property there we can use it and export it and here we can import it. For that I create one simple file and I say here CSS style CSS style dot JS remember that I am using here css style.js and i am just cut this setting here and i paste here and in place of this interface i say export remember that i put here export and then done it is what then this is also so i remove it because i doesn't require it i save it it will generate error if I save and I save it here also you will see it would not found this property where is this and generating error so what we do just I do import of the file CSS props one dot props like this from this CSS style and I save this so this error gone Similarly, I copy this and I paste it here also and I save this and you see that we have the import from this file. Similarly, we have this from here and we export it. Now we try to execute. We have a same effect here, but the advantage is that this is only declared in a single file one time and two components are using it by import so that is the most important part of web development that we try to reduce the size that that means it will run fast and for that we can reduce the size also because without any 
advantage we are just repeating the code in different different component if thousands of components are there and again we are just using the same line of code again and again in all the component that is not a good way of programming so here just we put it in a single file and now we are using in this from this file and only once place we have in later if we want to make some modification in this setting so we can also setting we can also modify it only a one single place and all the place will reflect without any problem so that is the way of uh, exporting the interface similarly we can uh, uh, we can also import the type also so i just make it comment here i just i just make it comment here and similar way is for type also so i say type and here i say equal to and i save this so the same way we just the writing syntax type is different but the way of using or importing all are same and you will see that we have a same type of output nothing is changed nothing is changed everything is similar but in place of interfaces we have used type so both we can export like this so depend on you what you want to use whether you prefer type or whether you prefer interfaces but for my point of view interface is better than the type because it's just a more object oriented side so i prefer that otherwise all are equivalent nothing is special about this so from this video we learn that how we can make uh, optimization of code and how we can import and export the property type or data type interfaces and type also for our application purpose that's all in this video if you like this please do subscribe thank you for watching this video